Hey, welcome to the show. Take a look at this. This is the WhalesBot E7 Pro. It is a coatable robotics kit. Take a look at the case, which you're going to get here. You're going to get all these cool parts and sensors. They even have a tray in here if you want to separate your parts out. If you don't want that tray, like I took my tray out, then you can keep all the parts in here just like this. Um, I'll tell you, there are so many things in here, so many different projects and uh, that you can make with this. I think they offer about 12 uh, STEM activities with all these parts, but here's a motor right here, but you're gonna get different sensors, all kinds of cool tracks and wheels, and this is one of the projects that we made, and I'll tell you, the students had a fantastic, fun time making this. We're using um, an iPad right here, you have a screen right here that comes up with the WhalesBot E7 Pro. You click on that, it'll load, then it'll open up and now you can collect whatever creation you want to start making. So here you have the little car, advanced car, Bigfoot, little beetle, the rhino. We did the Explorer, that's what this one is right here. But they got some other real cool ones and all you have to do is just hit the download and you get the instructions. Let's take a closer look at the Explorer right here. So you'll see when you start this screen up, it, it talks about what parts you're gonna need. And if you wanna know the total number of parts, you just uh, click right here and it gives you all the different parts that you're gonna use for this project. So go ahead and click it back. And then you can also take this and rotate it around. So the students will find that part and then you go ahead and start clicking the arrows and putting that together. So the cool thing about robotics is sometimes you'll come across problems or difficulties. Uh, for instance, the students were putting in the wrong size peg right here. So they had to do some problem solving and then go back to where they um, kind of messed up and then they just started over again. So it's really easy to follow. And if you want to, you can even zoom in and you can turn the model around just like that. And then when you're ready to go to the next step, it's that simple. So you can see all the different parts that you're gonna be putting together. And then you have to hook up the sensors. So you can see on this car right here, they had to hook up all the sensors. This is battery power right here. So you have some different bumper sensors right here, light sensors. Here's our two wheels. This is what it looks like on the bottom part. And it's all ready to go. So when you finish, then you can um, go to either coding or a control. Let's take a look at the control right here. And then you're going to par it. So I'm going to hit uh, the control here and it says to par. And then now it's connected. And then my son is going to press the button so you can see it's moving back and forth. It just about ran off the table there. So that's kind of fun. Students had a lot of fun controlling the car. And then for coding, let's go ahead and do the coding part. He's going to hit that arrow right here. And now I'll go ahead and hit the block coding. And we'll put this a little closer. So the block coding is pretty simple. All you have to do is drag the pieces, the blocks, the coded blocks into place. And then you put the stop button after at the very end. And then, oops, you get to put one more in there. All right. And then you hit the go button. Whoa, that was so cool. Um, they even have some advanced steps right here, some loops. So the cool thing about this is that you can set up an obstacle course and have the robot, uh, that students have to code it so that it goes around like um, maybe you have a water bottle here and that the car has to go around it. Um, maybe it has to go touch something. So there's so many possibilities, but I'll tell you, this robotics kit has been super fun for my students and also my son and it's probably one of my most favorite robotics kit because it's easy to use and it's a great entry level to coding. So make sure you check this out on Amazon. I think you're gonna really like it. 
and take a uh, look at the other videos I'm going to be posting. So we're going to make some more uh, cool cars from Whalesbot. So I highly recommend it. It's an awesome robotics kit. Hey, have a great day out there, and we'll talk to you later. Adios. Goodbye. Goodbye.